Hi, this is Chris. Working as an architect building mobile solutions for many companies around the world, there are three things that I learned most organizations need to thrive in the digital world. But before going into that, let me tell you what's involved in most software projects like building an app. The first thing is that you need to have a plan. You need to know what you want to do and how to do it. The second thing is that you need to get your information in order. And the third is, of course, that you need to define the functionality that the app should deliver. So coming back to what most organizations need is basically the same thing, but on a larger scale. So the first thing they need to do is to start the digital transformation journey. And that basically means to have a plan for the whole organization on how to adopt digital technologies. The second thing is that they need to get the information, their most important information in order, like customers and product data. And that usually happens through a master data management initiative. And the third thing is that they need to get their omnichannel services up. And to illustrate this, I, I've made this animation that you can see here. And at the top, you have the devices or channels, if you like. And on these devices are running a number of touch points, which could be apps or webs. And, and as you can see, the touch points are moving really fast to, to keep up with the fast pace of the digital world. In contrast, at the bottom, you see a number of slowly moving backend systems. And the reason why they're slow is because they're hard to change. And, and how do we get the information and the, and the functionality that the fast moving touch points need, even if the backend systems can't provide it? And the answer is the middle tiers, and that's the omnichannel services. So you wonder, how can these omnichannel services provide the functionality even if the backend system can provide it? And the answer is really simple. They provide temporary solutions. And when those temporary solutions are later replaced when the backend systems catch up, the nice part is that since they have well-defined service interfaces, the touch points are not affected by that change. So to sum it up, the first thing, start your digital transformation journey. The second, get your information in order. And the third, get those omnichannel services up there. And with that, I wish you the best of luck on your digital transformation journey. And thank you very much. Bye.